guys, how's going on? My name is Luis and God bless every single one of you. Today is January 11, 2024 and welcome to the Grand Supreme News Channel. All right, guys, so we have some urgent information coming out. If you can, please share this video. And it says here a 2.4 magnitude earthquake hit near a North K nuclear test site on December 11th. This information is coming out right now, and the big question is, was it an earthquake or did North K test one of their big NUKE? All right, so I do believe that there's a possibility North K test one of their big ones. Uh, we're talking about uh, a BOMB, all right? So, and, and this happened December 11th. All right, so according to South K State Weather Agency, now, which analyzed the quake as having occurred naturally. Now, the quake was detected 41 kilometers north, west of this region, which is home to the, yeah, nuclear test site. All right, guys, before I start, give this video a big thumbs up. Share this video with your friends, families, and loved ones. I appreciate the love and support. And for those of you that want to contribute to the channel, once again, the PayPal link and the Patreon link is in the description box. Also, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get your access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. And for those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. All right, so December 11th, two, uh, 2023, there was a 2.4 that struck this uh, uh, very important um, test site. Like I said, guys, I believe uh, they, they tested one of their powerful... N U K E. Usually, when it's a two point, uh, when it's a two point four, um, which uh, give me a second, let me just pull up the map here. So where was the location at? Give me a second. So it was in this region. I'm gonna pull up the map. Give me a second here. All right, so here's the map. Um, yeah, it's showing me something else. It's showing something else here. It's showing fin Finland. I mean that's what I uh, I posted on Google. For some reason, it's just showing that region. All right, but it did happen. It happened here. All right, so it happened. It happened this region. Uh, North K. All right, so they did test. Uh, I mean. Again, according to sources, there was a 2.4 magnitude earthquake uh, that struck near the nuclear test site. Uh, but my, my, again, my gut tells me that uh, they might have uh, tested something underground that caused that uh, uh, that uh, shaking. And I'm trying, I actually apologize, guys. All right, give me a second here. Let's go back to the article really quick and see what's going on with this one all right so again west of that region which is home to uh the nuclear test site all right so the quake was detected at 7 p.m that's 6 p.m signal poor time at a depth of 20 kilometers according to the k meteorological administration so 20 kilometers uh, again, what is that? Like 15, 16 miles deep. So that's like almost perfect um, location to keep like certain silos and um, certain, uh, you know, test underground stuff like that. 
All right, so it says here, this region, which I pull up on Google Map and it sent me all the way to Finland. <laughs> so this region has seen a string of small natural shake in recent months. Well, there's a possibility they might be, t uh, you know, testing something um, recent months. Who knows? Maybe you have the bear scientist out there uh, helping North K build something very powerful and they're doing this underground. And you guys know, again, you guys know the bear is a country, R-U-S-S-I-A. All right, all right, so between 2006 and 2017, North K conducted six of the NUKE tests at this region facility. Now, in 2017, this... Uh, facility triggered a much bigger 6.3 magnitude that was felt across the border with the red dragon i know the red dragon called him up and say hey if you guys doing something underground can you not so they probably call him up and told him knock it off <laughs> all right um stockpiles it says here at the, this region year and policy meetings, North K leader um, blank a NUKE on the south. Once again, I'm skipping certain names here, and call for a buildup of his land uh, military ahead of a huge event that he warned could break out any time. Yikes. Once again, the leader also successfully put a satellite into orbit late in 2023 after receiving what uh, South K Capital said was the bear help in exchange for some very powerful stuff transfer to the bear country. All right. So I do believe that there's a possibility there are some bear scientists out there and they're helping North K. Remember, North K is also helping the bear. Something, uh, something underground is, uh, you know, it's happening. And guys, t uh, talking about underground, uh, I got a video coming up over at Grand Supreme News. There is a lot more information about those tunnels in that Big Apple. So, a uh, very, very, very important information. We got some updates. Uh, you wouldn't want to miss this one. Again, make sure you follow me at Grand Supreme News. All the information will be in the comments box. All right. So in 2017, the test sparked a global uh, global condemnation, leading the U blank um, some new sanks. All right. So they slapped North K with this here. North K really don't care. They have a whole bunch of detention slip. All right, so it says here, monitoring groups estimated that six NUKE test had a yield of up to 250 kilometers, which is 16 times the size of the sleeping giants where they dropped in 1945. 16 times more powerful. Let's stop here for a second. The sleeping giant dropped not one, but two. Two was good enough. They were waving the white flag and say, hey, sleeping giant, you guys win. You guys win. Forget it. We done. You win. So North K is building something that is 16 times more powerful than that. What the sleeping drop, uh, what the sleeping giant dropped in 1945. All right. So following the 2017 test, the North claim it had, uh, look at that. I'm just going to highlight it. So once again, they had det detonated a very powerful BOMB of unprecedentedly um, big power, saying it marked a very significant occasion in achieving the final goal of becoming a complete NUKE power. The Sleeping Giant intelligence official estimated in 2018 that North K Capital had enough material, the core component of NUKE for 65, wow, 65 more 
and that it produces enough uh, material for 12 additional every year. A 2021 uh, report from the, I'm going to skip that name, uh, projected that North K could have more than 200 NUKE and hundreds of very powerful stuff stockpiled by 2027. 200 is good enough to basically uh, end a lot of stuff. I mean, just one NUKE uh, will kind of uh, stop everything. Now, I do believe that in the end times, scripture says in the end time, everything will be over and fire is going to completely finish everything. In the beginning, there was a flood. In the end, will be fire. And all these, uh, all these area will be launching their stuff left and right. And, um, you know, at the beginning, uh, God sent a flood and I do believe in the end, man will finish it off with great fire. And, uh, then the sun will increase and then the heavens elements would go out with a big, loud noise. All right. So basically, in the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. In the end, God will uncreate it. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Once again, for those of you that want to give your life to Christ, you can email me. My email is in the description box. Me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path. And that's the path of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. For those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Louis Santiago, or my wife, Jessica Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Once again, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get your access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about in the platform. Also, I'll post the videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ, for he's the only way, the truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father but through Jesus. Thank you so, uh, thank you so much for watching. Till next time later. Peace.